If you're looking to bolster your data center with a few Linux servers, why not add Debian into the mix? After all, you probably already have a few Ubuntu servers working non-stop for you, so why not include the Mothership distribution? Let's see how to install a minimal Debian server. I'll only be highlighting the more important screens, so you'll be on your own for part of this process. May the source be with you. The first screen you'll see is the installer menu. In this screen, select Install, not Graphical Install, as there are certain options to be had in the standard installation that you'll want. This installer is NCurses based, so you'll use your keyboard cursor to move up and down a selection list, your spacebar to select an option, and the tab key to switch from selection list to the OK, Go Back, Yes, No options. The next window that will require your interaction is the host name configuration. Type the host name for the system, hit the tab key to continue, and hit enter on your keyboard. Once you have the time zone configured, you'll be presented with the disk partition tool. Select the type of partitioning you want to use and hit enter. Next, you'll select the disk to be partitioned. Next comes the package management section of the installation. For this, you'll be required to first select the mirror to be used for package download. Eventually, you'll reach the package selection window. For the minimal installation, deselect any desktop environment, select web server, print server, SSH server, and standard system utilities. Once you've made the selections, tab to continue and hit enter. The final two screens ask if you want to install the Grub bootloader and where to install it. Once you've taken care of this, your Debian minimal server will reboot and you can log in to start working. Hey everybody! Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and be sure to check out more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.